Yo, what up, it's Don. Sammy Lee here. We are the Soul Brothers, back with a Adidas versus video. Boost on Boost Crime. Um, this is the Crazy Explosion 2017. Um, and uh, versus the Boost you wear X. Yeah, so that's the basketball version. There's a level one you might see around, but it's not as um, uh, well equipped for basketball. Yes. But let's hop in on the versus video. Starting with the traction, uh, we have the the patented brain brain stem traction pattern on um, the crazy explosion, and it's good. It's uh, good, yeah. It, it's not great. Um, not the craziest bite. Does pick up a little bit of dust, but you know it'll get the job done. Yes. And uh, same thing with the boost you wears. Uh, the the traction is like really good on the clean court. I would say for both of them, but they both pick up a little bit of dust. Mm -hmm. um, but once you wipe for both of them, they, they have a few good, uh, really good stops and then um, you need to wipe again. But, um, and also outdoor use is probably not good for uh, both of them either, uh, also. Yeah, I would say the, the crazy explosion is almost even a little worse. Yes, exactly. The, 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 the grooves are real soft and pliable. Yep. But performance wise, I would say they're actually pretty much the same. Yeah. So I tie it up. Yeah, for sure. Uh, moving on to the cushion, uh, the boost you wear is, um, I, I can feel it a little bit more, I feel like, in the boost you wear X. Um, it is decoupled, I don't really like that feeling. Mm -hmm. um, but um, And also the heel compression, I would say, is a little bit better in the crazy explosive, right? Yeah. Uh, you can feel it a little bit more, yeah. but just like the overall cushion, I feel like it's a little bit softer of a ride. Mm -hmm. And um, uh, impact protection, it, I feel like it's a little bit better. Um, but uh, court feel, you feel low to the ground in both of the shoes. But mm -hmm. in the crazy explosive, it's still it's still nice and plush. Yeah, they're both like basically full length boost besides the decoupling and the boost you wear. Yeah. Um. Oh, what setup do you like better, dude? I think I like the crazy explosive better. Really? Yeah, because I don't. It, it's um, just I don't like that decoupled. Yeah. Outsole and in 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 midsole. But is that a part of cushion though? Kind of. Not well, really. Well, yeah, I because kinda it kind of is because it, cushion goes along heavily with a heel to toe transition to me. Yeah. You know, and this is just like a, a nicer ride. Yeah. To me, but, but this feels, isn't bad too. It feels softer to me though in the boots you wear. Mm. Um, but yeah. like it doesn't have a crazy heel compression to yeah. me for some reason. Um, I don't know, man. It's, it's pretty hard. Yeah, they're, they're pretty close. Yeah, they're pretty close. You but, know, uh, it, the major differences is the heel heel uh, compression is better in the crazy explosive. It's decoupled, and uh, we don't really like the decoupled uh, yeah. feeling. And uh, but it's a little bit softer. You can feel the boost a little bit more in the boost mm -hmm. you wear. So uh, just pick on what you would like. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? But anyways, moving on to the upper, uh, you do have um, we're are they calling this a prime knit? This, yeah, it's got guess, a right? It's a knit. Yeah, it's a knit. It's a real strong knit. Very, yeah, very strong. It doesn't stretch really yeah. at all. Uh, mixed with some uh, old school premium materials like suede. And there is a very stretchy knit. Um, and it feels super nice. Mm -hmm. uh, very supportive also, but super soft. And um, same thing with the Crazy Explosive, man. Yeah, it's these a, are nice too. This is a Forged Prime Knit, right? Yeah, Forged Prime Knit. Yeah. You can tell by the lines. Looks like the uh, Alpha Bounce kind of. Yeah. And uh, super strong, super sturdy uh, upper. And, you know, it's nice, soft to the touch. Not as soft as, you know, parts of, of, of the um, BYW. Yeah. There's parts on the BYW that are just softer. I, I don't know. I would say the BYWs are a little... And nicer, yeah, and also the crazy explosive is very, very thick and puffy. yeah, it's puffy. Remember that? So yeah, I, that's why I don't really like it as much. Yeah. So I, I take the booster wear materials, yeah, same here. Yeah, uh, moving on the fit, uh, go true to your Adidas size for both of the shoes. Um, and uh, I would say the crazy explosive is a lot narrower, right? Mm. And the yeah, they're wear, both really narrow for me, really. Yeah. Booster wear, I feel like, is a little bit wider to me. Mm -hmm. um, the crazy explosive when I first put it on is actually like really really tight and once I broke it in it got a little bit better but boost you wear it was uh, width wise was really good for me mm -hmm. uh, so I feel like it's more of a normal width um, but and they also both have the actual like ankle stretch thing what are we yeah. calling this ankle knit 
Yeah, but this one has two pull tabs, which is nice. Oh, <laughs> yeah. It's easier to get your foot in and out of. Exactly. Which is cool, so. Um, but, yeah, both of them are um, really good fits for both of us, mm -hmm. so uh, there's that. Yep. Uh, support wise, I would say they're both uh, pretty good. Yeah. I, would, I would say the Boosie Wear is a little bit more supportive. There mm -hmm. is uh, like a plastic piece that goes, I think it's connected with the suede. So I think right. it's a plastic piece, a really thin plastic piece with the suede over it. And uh, also the boost does cage you up a lot from yeah. the auto containment. I mean, the plastic does come up a little bit on the crazy explosive. Yeah, but it's not as much. It's more yeah. of just a pliable rubber. Exactly. Um, but these are, you know, you're not going to have any support problems with these. Yeah. They, they, they really focused on support in the new um, Crazy Explosives. So, uh, but yeah, the, the BYW is a little bit more, I would say. Yeah. Right. And also, uh, Lockdown, they're both good. They're both I didn't good. really have any issues. When I, when I crank down on here, I mean, very good. Uh, I'm not getting my foot out. Exactly. It will not come out. And these are, 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 are pretty, pretty much the same, so... Yes. Um, tie it up there. Yes. Uh, let's check out weight now. Now both of these, I don't think are gonna be the lightest shoe because it's Adidas. Yeah. Right. They they don't really make the lightest shoes. I mean, twelve point four two for the boost you wear is not bad. It's not bad. It's kind of average. Yes. Crazy explosive is twelve point nine one. Hmm. So the crazy explosive is uh, a little heavier. What feels lighter? I would say the boost you wear by a little bit because mm, the yeah. crazy explosive material is a little bit puffier. And it feels like you have a little bit more stuff on your foot, but they're both really responsive yeah. and uh, very good. So uh, yeah, there's sure. that. Um, ventilation, uh, these are hot. Yeah, the Crazy Explosive is hot. They're, I mean, it's like a double, triple sock you're wearing. Yeah. Booster Wear is not too bad. Yeah. So I gave it to the Booster Wear. Yeah. The ventilation. Uh, durability. Durability, they're both not too good. I would, I would think this outsole is a little more durable. And the materials too, right? And the materials, so yeah. maybe even the BYW. Exactly. Um, okay, so... Uh, aesthetics? Aesthetics. Ooh, I don't BYW. know. BYW. Really? Oh, yeah. I like I like both. I like both. Especially that, that colorway. I never really loved the 2017s. Really? Aesthetically. Tell us what you guys think of the yeah. aesthetics. What looks better? Um, so, you know, wrapping things up. How much were the boots you wear? Like one, 180. 180, oh yeah. yeah. 180, which is hella expensive. Crazy. That's insane. Ain't nobody got money for that. Yeah. Except and, us. <laughs> except us. <laughs> and the crazy explosive is 150 bucks. So that's that's 30 bucks. That's a lot of money. Um, so if, if money is an issue, yeah, the crazy explosive is a very, very good option. But the boost you wear is a very, very good performer also. Yeah. And uh, if money doesn't matter to you, I would definitely try and pick these up. Yeah. Um, Adidas killed it. The only thing I really don't like about it is a decoupling. Yeah. It's not a huge issue, but it's just a little minor gripe for both of us. But other than that, yeah. And if the traction was super nasty, yeah. that, that sh this shoe would be crazy. It's still good. I mean, it's but still like, crazy, but... Yeah, if it was like Dero's 8, Dero's 7 yeah. status, Kyrie 2... This would be one of the best ball shoes. Yeah. But it's still one of the best ball shoes that came out this year so far. Yeah. And a lot of good performances have come out so far this year. So, uh, namely like PG2, Kyrie 4, is that it? <laughs> um, uh, Hardens. Curry 4. Curry 4. Um, so, those are uh, all new, but they're all top performers. So, yeah. anyways, that's it. Uh, that's the Versus video. Hope you helped you guys out. And we'll see you guys next one. Later. Peace.